Hello, BWR family. I am finally out and about this morning. Um, I wanted to show you guys a little update on the garden before I start to clean out the trailer for our special time for our anniversary. Here are the watermelons, guys. I ended up digging those up and I replanted and direct sold the seed. I put three in here so we will see how that goes. Here is the um, potatoes. They're growing like crazy. I know they don't like a lot of water so what I'm gonna end up doing is moving those under the porch because it's rained every day this week. So I'm gonna have to move them. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna show you is the corn. The corn is getting really tall. I went on ahead and thinned them out. I picked the best one and I left that one and I took out the one that seemed a little bit more weak. So here's that. Um, you can see them in there. I left them in even though, you know, I cut them down because I feel like it'll be a good fertilizer, I guess. So that's the corn and they're getting really tall. They're not quite knee high yet. They're like half of my um, calf. Here is the um okra they look really good as well i went on ahead and picked out the best one for the okra as well one of them did not do any germination as you can see so that's okay we still have the other um five all right now on to the main bed and i call it the main bed because oh there is a mushroom growing I gotta get that out. <laughs> so there's a couple of mushrooms. Ooh. So it's probably because I used the mushroom compost. But anyway, so here is the main bed. We have our lettuce finally doing a lot better than it was. I think it just needed to be fed. Here are the peppers. I topped those off and they have gone crazy with the leaf growth so i'm really happy about that the spinach is looking okay ish i guess um the uh carrots are looking really good some are taller than others now this is the one that i'm like wow it is growing like crazy can y'all see that it is the zucchini i can't even see the sign but it already has a male flower on it. I believe that's a male flower on there. I don't see any female flowers just yet. The squash is starting to produce flowers. And like those are the male flowers. I don't see any female on that one either. Then we have our beans and they are growing like crazy. There are more <laughs> mushrooms in here. I probably won't use that type of compost again. The tomatoes are doing fantastic. They're doing a lot better growing in here with more room and more food. Um, the garden beans are doing great. I ended up cutting off an extra leaf because their leaves are producing really well. The um, basil is bushing out fantastic. The onions are getting bigger. The cabbages are growing. Their leaves are getting bigger. I have a loose um, carrot over here. I don't know how it got down there, but so everything is looking good. So yeah, so that's the update on the um, garden. So I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna pull some of these mushrooms out of here and then I'll start to clean the trailer. show you guys again um, everything is moved now so that looks good now it'll be time to start the process get my boo hey please give me a kiss <laughs> <Yeah. Me too. laughs> 
So yeah, now I'm gonna go in here and uh ooh, my eyes. See? Do one more sweep and then um when Davy leaves, I'll go ahead and start the process. I'm really excited. I'm hoping that this darn bed fits in here. We'll see. Alright guys. Alright guys, so now I'm about to go ahead and start decorating. Uh, David helped me, as you saw, to get most of this stuff out. I am going to start with the foundation um, and just cover the walls. And then what I'll do is probably do a separate video, maybe, I'm not sure, of how I even did everything, how everything was put together. And so I'll just show you guys this. And then I'll show you guys the finished look. So, all right, here we go. One thing I want to do is go ahead and spray some Raid in here because I don't have time for bugs and stuff. And I don't know if there's any in here. So that's the first thing I'm going to do. I would hate to sleep in here. And have something crawling on me. Not what's up. And it'll help with the smell too, because you got lavender in it, so. Mm -hmm. This is what we're working with so far. I'm gonna put another one so that it will cover that bottom half. And I'm gonna bring it all the way around. All right guys, so we are in an all white room now. So yeah, I have it draped in white. You can still see the wood um, behind it, but that's fine because the lights are gonna be down and I'm gonna have like little, you know, um, these little lights right here all over. So I'm not really worried about that. I tried to swagger some of the excess fabric, but yeah, so now I'm gonna move on to the next part. Hey guys, so we ran into a bit of a snafu. Um, it is beginning to rain and we have a leak and I'm going to have to end up showing David this place before it's finished because he's going to have to fix it because <laughs> we don't want to be laying in water or eating in water or mold start growing and whatnot. But I will show you what I've done so far. So this is when you first walk in. We have our place setting. Our little area we're gonna have food at this is the drapes and I have them all the way from the top to the bottom and it's also going across the top I plan on putting lights either up here or along the sides where the um, tablecloth is folded at that might even be better and what I'm gonna do let me go this way is we're gonna be having the movie in this area okay so i plan on putting the projector i think david's outside the you don't know that part so the projector is going to be up here i'm gonna cut a little hole so that our monogram can play and i'm going to show you um i guess what the monogram looks like but it's really pretty guys so the surprise got ruined a little bit but he still doesn't know every single detail so I'm just going to look at it positively as far as being able to find a leak in here and fixing it. We fixed some leaks that they had. He got in, he had in this trailer before. Um, we noticed that when he bought it, there was one up here and he fixed that. So I'm just glad we caught it and I'm glad we caught it before, you know, I put food on this little area because that would have been tragic. <laughs> so yeah so i'll check in with you guys as it gets closer um i still have a few more things to pick up and i'm still waiting on his gift to get here it said it was supposed to be delivered yesterday and it's still not here so 
We're on a bit of a time crunch. If I have to, I'll put a picture of it off and give it to him in the box. <laughs> so, hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. But anyway, so I will check back in with y'all a little bit later on. All right, bye. Wait a minute, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get his reaction to how it looks. How about that? That'll be good. Oh, here we go, here he is. Come in, babe. Got Baby's reaction. <laughs> Even though it's not time yet, but it's okay. Hey y'all, so we are out and about this morning. I have the girls with me. The boys are with David. It is our actual anniversary day, yeah. I have some loose ends that I need to take care of. And they are getting a screen for the trailer so that we can open it up because it's extremely hot in there. If you guys don't know, I will blast the air condition. Just blast it and they be freezing and stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and get that taken care of. I got all the food. One change is that we're not gonna do the steak because the lobster tails are dry normal. It's just, they're big. So, and I'll show you guys that. Um, I'm gonna start prepping those when I get home. I'm trying to think. Um, I have to blow up the air mattress. I have to... What else? Finish a little bit more in the trailer and then that'll be done. All right guys, so we are back home and I have the oops, <laughs> magic mesh. So we're gonna see how this works out. It looks pretty easy to put together. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that and whatever else I gotta do. All right, bye y'all. <sighs> y'all, it is so hot, I done came out my shirt. So I have the thing finally up so we can get some air circulating in here but I still think we're gonna need a fan or something but it opens up just fine So this is our little spread. That thing is huge. Our little spread in my boot. So we got the kids fed. Now it's our turn to eat. So I'm gonna close the vlog out. If no one else tells you, you're here for me. You're valuable, you have worth, and you're rare. Be good.